New at five, an elaborate scarecrow that children and parents created for a school fundraiser was stolen and burned. Channel 2, Tom Regan is live in Cherokee County with how police caught the teenager responsible and what he said when they arrested him. Tom? Well, the scarecrow that was stolen here last week was one of 20 on display on this main street in downtown Ball Ground. It's all part of a fundraising project for a local elementary school. They had hoped that the scarecrow would come back in one piece, but sadly, that wasn't the case. Scarecrows of all shapes and sizes dot the main street here through Ball Ground, but one of the favorites is missing from its bale of hay display. It's Uncle Cy Robertson, the scarecrow portraying the popular character from the hit TV reality show Duck Dynasty. It disappeared one night last week. Obviously, you're not thinking about oh, the time someone put in this. You're just like, oh, well, this, this could be fun. Parents and fourth graders at Ball Ground Elementary spent dozens of hours and hundreds of dollars creating the elaborate scarecrow. After it was stolen, police offered a $1,000 reward for its safe return. Someone called in a tip. They had actually seen it on a porch located uh, outside the city. But the chief told me when they went to check, they discovered a crime scene. Cy, the scarecrow, had been burned to bits. And soon came the confession from a 16-year-old who stole it. He got really scared of, the, uh, of what might happen to him if he got caught with it. And then he, he decided to either burn it. He felt bad about what he did. He actually uh, wanted to talk about going and apologizing to the class. I don't even know why they were scared to steal a scarecrow and burn, them burn it. Students and parents outside the school told me they were both surprised and upset over losing old Uncle Cy. These kids at school, they put their heart and soul into that scarecrow. I don't see why they did that. It was very special to the community. Why, why do you feel sad about it? Because they took a lot of time doing that. Well, the 16-year-old faces a juvenile charge of theft. He has expressed some interest in reimbursing the parents for the expenses uh, and the cost that they put into creating that scarecrow. The school tells me at this point they haven't decided whether they're going to create another scarecrow to replace Uncle Cy. Reporting live in Cherokee County, Ballground, Tom Regan, Channel 2 Action News. Tom, I don't know. I think him reimbursing the parents is probably the least he could do, huh? Absolutely, absolutely. They, the parents, from what I understand, spent like 500 bucks to create this scarecrow. And as you can see, it's like no scarecrow I ever seen before. So the least he could do uh, is try to reimburse, not, if not all of it, at least a portion of that $500. That's and right. maybe help them build another one. That's, I was going to say, work it off somehow. That's right. Tom, thank you.